So we left off here that uh, without the event, it should populate the data for us. As you know, if I come here, we send our Ajax request and we get the title. Uh, we post the title here and we emit the event, our custom event. As I said, we can pass the second data as the second parameter here. So how you are going to do that? If you come here and write an object like the above, title is going to be this the title now you can send data of title to our task created event that is very simple now you can take only that data and append that to our array list if I save it, this file come to our uh, task list here for now again I will take out this excuse request uh, okay anywhere you can put them for example I can just put them down here this is our event listener for our for the custom event as you can see this one will just show the data but for the second one when we say task was created now I just want to have the title here it will get the title and it should display it or append it to the task list I will say task this dot tasks dot push very simple now I'll pass the title here this is that much simple now I will save it here so this should do the trick as you can see first of all they send a uh, jack request and get the data second it, it will listen for the event or uh, our custom event and if we have uh, uh, any it will just append data or push it to our array list here so if I save everything and refresh the page here this time it should work just fine as you know we have our list of uh, tasks here so new task if I press add as you can see it will automatically display here this is very simple without refreshing the page now we can perform our single page application or Ajax request and we get data from this uh, from database and display it here so I hope it has been informative for you if you have any question feel free to ask below the video and I will answer them I know these things are some of for some people these are easy for some people they are a little complicated but I will be there to help you if you have any question. So that's it I think for this video. And I have a little request for you. If you have time, go to the GitHub. This is just optional. Feel free to do or do not. Taylor Artwell, the creator of Laravel, they have put a contest. They will give a prize for the, the one who, who has the best article for the Laravel like related. And I have written an article here the easiest way to create an ACL I have a video on this channel and the video got a lot of view and a lot of likes and I thought I can write just an article about this on medium and I post it here this is this is just a three minute three minutes reading and you can come here read it and you can create an ACL if you come here and give me a thumbs up and I will be thankful and that is what you can do for me to support me Thank you, this is completely optional, feel free to do or do not, or you can come to the issue and see all other articles here and vote for them as well. That is, uh, that's it for this video, thank you for watching and see you in the next video.